Hi there, this is a very short video giving you some instructions on how to organize uh, my courses and course lists in Blackboard Learn. After you've been in Blackboard for a while, you'll start to get this very long list uh, of courses. This is particularly true for instructors. Every semester we add more courses to your list and uh, the list just keeps growing and growing. And sometimes this list is not in an obvious order. It can be very easy to confuse one course site from last year this time with a course site that's new, you know, the one that you're teaching right now. Blackboard does have a way, though, to let you organize these course sites by semester, but it's not done by default. And what I'd like to show you today is how to, to make that change. So here I am, I've just logged into Blackboard and this is my home page. And over on the right hand side, I have this My Courses section. And you'll notice that when I hover over it, this little gear icon appears and it's labeled my, uh, Manage my, course, my Courses Module Settings. That's a mouthful. Uh, if we click there, a menu will pop up that gives us some options uh, for how we want that list to appear. I would say the most important one you want to click off here is the one that says Group by Term. Just going to click that on and while you'll see that some new options appear, I just want to quickly save this. I'm going to submit and go back and you'll notice immediately <laughs> that things are looking a lot better now. I have subheadings telling me which term these courses are in so it's very easy to see that I've got summer here, my fall courses are there and so forth. You do have further options you can set, clicking on that gear again. Uh, you can choose whether to show certain terms at all on this list. Perhaps you only want the summer courses to appear, right? We can hide all of the rest of them and submit. And now I'm only seeing ones that are summer. Uh, and, and you have further options as well. You can drag these things up and down. That's what this little, see it, how this arrow appears? I'm, I'm just going to use that as a handle to drag these things about into whatever order I like. And you can also specify at the course level. You know, I don't want this course to ever show up on my site again. I, I don't want it on my My Courses list, even though I am a member of the site. So again, you can fine tune these settings as you like. Feel free to play around and you know, find a mix that works for you. I'm just gonna cancel that set of changes. And the one thing I wanted to point out is that I'm on my home page right now. This is my so-called My Courses list. But we also have this tab at the top of the page labeled Courses. And when I click there, I get, well, sort of the same list. But as you can see, this one is not sorted by term. However, you'll also see that there is a settings icon here as well. The settings that you set for your home page, My Courses list, don't automatically transfer over to your Courses course list. but you can make the same settings. I mean, the, the options all appear to be the same. You just have to set them twice if you are using both your home page and your courses page to, to navigate. So again here, I'm just going to set group by term. I really find that's the most important thing. Although this is sort of nice too. I mean, you can say leave those other terms, leave the past terms in place, but don't expand them, right? Leave them as a collapsed subheading. And you'll notice that when we come back to the page, the summer courses are wide open. I can see them listed, but for the others, I have to, to click to expand them. That's actually sort of what I like. I, the, the most important recent stuff is at hand, but you can still quickly access the old sites. So please give this a try your, on your own. I think you'll find that it really helps you to, to clean up your, your course level navigation in Blackboard.